On our first 90 minutes for you in, in pre-season, how did you find out there? Yeah, it was really tough. Um, yeah, first half obviously it was 50-50 sort of game because um, we were both fresh. But then obviously in the second half they bought a new um, starting 11 out, so and they're, they're all nice and fresh. So yeah, it was tough, but I thought I thought we did well. Like kept our shape well, and it was a, a different sort of test to what we've had in pre-season so far. Yeah, it was interesting watching from the sidelines because everyone was saying what great tempo there was to the game. And I guess in pre-season that's probably the, well, I say the last thing you want. But as a player, you get used to season pretty quickly if the games are like that. Yeah, definitely. But um, even in the other games, like it was a bit frustrating because on the, on the pitch, like we were playing on and it was quite dry and uh, playing against teams um, not, like no disrespect, but a bit lower. Mm. And so those were the games where we really, I think, struggled a bit to try to keep the tempo on. But um, yeah, but today there was no problems with that. Yeah, and that's the way the gaffer wants to play with a, with a high tempo. Yeah, was it easier playing those kind of games as a centre half, or was it worse going in midfield? Because I guess in midfield you've got to concentrate when the ball comes in terms of making things happen, but also be wary of the movement that they've got. On yeah, the definitely. Court. Especially um, we even went down to ten men. I think with I think Boydie got cramped. So yeah, so trying to keep your shape, and when they keep switching it, yeah, it's tough on the legs, but it's uh, good to get used to it. Obviously, as you say, you've played six pre-season games now in, in terms of the preparations for the new season. Two games left to go in terms of pre-season. You just get itching to get started now. Yeah, yeah, looking forward to the season. Um, yeah, like I say, um, it's been really tough this pre-season. Um, with all the games, it's been like we've actually been in the season itself, Tuesday, Saturday, but the lads will be more happy doing that than, uh, than training, definitely, and uh, hopefully it'll get us up to speed quicker. Yeah, as I say, it's so weird this pre-season because we've been back quite a long while and obviously the, the games have come thick and fast, but that's going to replicate when the season kicks off because there's going to be no rest. Yeah, definitely we have to get used to it, like um, how condensed the fixtures are with the Tuesday, Saturdays. Um, I think all the squad's going to have to be used, so we all need minutes, we all have to be ready. Yeah, that's the thing is that you mentioned that all the squad's going to be used. There's going to be no sulking if you're not in the side because you could change very quickly. Yeah, you can't do that. Yeah, definitely. Especially when everyone's got the same goal. You can't have anyone sulking, no. no. Obviously, pre-season here at St George's Park. Have you found it this week? You've been here before or is this first time? No, I've been here once before, but like, it's brilliant. I didn't stay where we've been staying and eating where we've been eating. It's been brilliant. They've been so good to us letting us use all the facilities, especially like the pitches. It's been absolutely brilliant. And just finally, who did you end up rooming with? Because that's key on the pre-season, isn't it? You don't want to get lumbered with oh, someone I always room with Butts. He wouldn't let me room with anyone else. Is that a good thing, do you think? I, mean, I don't know, it's a bit controlling. Yeah. Yeah, but it's all right. He's a little bit older than me, so he likes to... Play, the, play that card. Yeah, he, lo he loves it. He likes the power trip. <laughs> <laughs>